Welcome back to Subnautica, the original game. We are going to be on this planet, 4546B, for quite a while. So we've started to make a little base. And we have our bobo tree. Yeah, bobo tree growing. So that's good. Gives us lots of food. And our little melons that are growing here again, because I just ate a whole bunch of them. They give us uh, lots of water. The potato plants actually give us lots of food too. So we're gonna go up to our life pod so we can use the fabricator. And we have a message too. So. Let me explain what's going on. Well, let's, let's swim around a little bit so we have something to look at while I explain. We have... Um, we have to build a rocket in order to meet the Altera Corporation halfway in order to get uh, rescued, you stay over there. But in order to get off the planet with the rocket, we need, oh. Oh, you're up there. <laughs> you biting me, I want this. I want the extra, um, Titanium. So we have to, in order to get the rocket off the ground, off the planet, we have to turn off that gun building. And in order to turn off that gun building, we have to not be infected with the bacteria that's on this planet. And in order to not be infected, we have to find the laboratory and since the laboratory is 800 meters below the surface of the water, in order to find the laboratory, we have to build a ship that will allow us to go that low in the water. The ship we're going to build is the Sea Moth, which is pretty easy. We have basically everything we need, but in order to build the Sea Moth, we need the mobile vehicle bay. So this is the first thing we're going to build. And we have everything for that. There's a life pot. There it is. So we build the mobile vehicle bay, build the sea moth, be able to travel around, go deeper. We can find this laboratory, we can cure ourselves of the disease, we can um what's the new thing we have? Oh creature decoys, yeah. What do they use? Titanium wire kits, they're expensive. So let's make titanium ingot. And now we should be able to make mobile wheel bay because we had the lubricant already. We made that from um, the creep vine seeds and the power cell we got in the Aurora when we were exploring it. I had to actually go back and get all the stuff that I left in those bags. But I brought it all back. Unfortunately, I couldn't bring all the bags back. Because you you can only put them in your inventory when they're empty. You can't fill them up and then put them in your inventory. Unfortunately. Release vehicle bag. Uh, let's get somewhere a little... 
keeper over here. And we can release it here. I thought I just heard voices. Like, what are you talking about? Oh, look at these little guys. <laughs> so, we can make ooh, Neptune escape rocket. Titanium ingot times two. Computer chip lead times four. Um, find some more lead and I think we can make that. No problem. Vehicles. Cyclops. Look at that. Big giant submarine. That's awesome. The sea moth is what we're making. Oh, and the prawn suit. Yeah. That'll help us get around as well. So, we need a titanium ingot which is 10 titanium. We need a power cell which we have. We need glass which is 2 crystal which we have. Lubricant which is the fine seeds and one piece of lead. Okay. Um, can I get out of here? Thank you very much. We need to get some creep fine seeds to make some lubricant. I think we already have Way, way. I think we already have lead and everything like that. What else do we oh we should have ten more titanium as well. Of course we also have radio message. We better listen to the radio message as well. Let's listen to the radio message. This is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. Another approximate one. Uh, let's see, life pod six. Mm, cliff, we got red grass. Uh, located in an area dense with red grass near a number of natural arches and rock stacks. Approximately 400 meters west northwest of life pod four. Okay, well, we know where life pod four is, so that should be easy to find. Are you done? Thank you. Let's see if we have enough titanium. What was that? Oh, a round thing moving there. I thought that was a fish or something sitting on me. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, dear. Uh, what am I looking for? Titanium. We got four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. And I have this locker over here filled with life kits. That's good. Um, let's see, we need. Oh, and I brought all the decoration stuff. Put that in there for now. We need battery, not a battery, a uh, power cell. We need a piece of lead and a power cell should be in here. Unfortunately, they're two fully charged power cells, but 
What can you do? Uh, let's see. Glass, that's what it was. Okay, that should be everything. Yep. Oh no, that's glass times two. Good thing we got all this crystal. Okay, we're gonna get this creep vine seed out of our pocket here. Plant it right in there. Did it go in there? Yeah, there it is. It's growing. It takes a long time. Well, not that long, but long enough. So we need a titanium ingot, which is 10 titanium. And we need two glass. You're making that funny noise for. Then we should have everything to make these sea moth. I kind of want to wait until the uh, daytime to make it though. So I want to be able to see it. Let's take all this stuff downstairs. Downstairs. Down to our a new base. Oh my goodness. Empty, empty. You're not empty. Another egg. Okay, they're all empty except for the eggs. Look how far it's grown already. Okay, get in there. She's not welcoming us because we are here already. Very uh, short little wall ago. Okay, um, where do I, I put salt in here yet? Keep all that. So let's get rid of some water. There's water. Water's over here. I think we're full on water. Let's switch a couple bottles around. Uh, yeah. That's enough. And let's fill up. room to pick all that. There. Come on, daylight. Where do I put my... my little mobile bay? There should be a beacon for it. see it, but why is there no beacon for it? Oh. The beacon's in the second game, not the first game. Okay. We're going to make a sea moth. The sea moth is a fast safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. My glutes are quite nice, thank you very much. <coughs> Excuse me. And here is our little sea moth. It's so cute. No, I don't want to change the power cell, what are you doing? 
I want to get in for. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, Monty. <laughs> Your uh, different voice. Turn the the lights off. See, now we can go fast, and we can go far, and we can go to a depth of 200 meters quite easily. First thing we have to do we need our repair kit and storage module as a cyclops. Oh, so we have a sea depth module take that take a couple beacons mm. I want to take you wait there for one second okay I want to take one emergency ration just in case You have to be prepared if you're going long distances, just in case. Okay. Now, there should be a hatch on this side here. Where are you? Don't bang into it. There, that hatch. Let's put this in. Oh no. I dropped it instead. No, oh, drop it. Butterfingers, what are you doing? Not to equip it. And equip the depth mod. Because now we can go to 300 meters and we have a storage on the side here. Is that another radio message? Sorry. Why do we have another radio message? Oh, that's not the radio. What are you doing? This is the radio. You're looking right at it. Uploaded to PDA. Okay, life pod 12. 250 meters in the ocean bed. Okay. So, question is. Twelve, or what was the number of the other one? Six. We've already found four. Four hundred meters west northwest of Life Point Four. All right, let's go find six first. Where's my little sea moth buddy here? Should be over here. See the temperature of the water is a nice 28 degree. Oh, it's you guys. You scare me every time, man. Stop it. You can go f faster. Oh, I'll we'll have to make some. Uh, 
power cells. Pod four, we can go north northwest, which is that way. Um, sunk to approximately a hundred meters, okay. tree-like things. Oh. <laughs> See, this is why I need the repair kit. Because mm -hmm. you can pop out, hit, no, number five. Repair it after banging into things all the time. Okay. Um, what are you looking for? Life pod six, that's what we're looking for. We're a little too low. that thing whoa giant electric eel uh, scan this thing I wish that you could scan from the sea moth that'd be cool oh can't scan it Keep track of where the sea moth is. Okay. I think we uh, we might have missed the pod we we're looking for. thing here somewhere can we scan these funny looking things yeah a tree mushroom not a mushroom tree and don't see any life pod can we scan this guy I think we did already didn't we yeah we scanned them already this stuff. Tree spawn. Shark in there. Uh, I don't see any life pot though. Good 
thing about the the sea moth is that it gives you oxygen. Salvage. We already got the mobile vehicle bay, but we can use the titanium. Hmm. Keep losing track of where they see me. Thank you. mushroom thing you go it's on the other side of this hill Sorry, fishy. Had the radio message? Come on, dudes, I'm trying to. The red grass. Oh, oh. sorry, Mr. Fish. to the thing. for but is that thing okay fish stop it will you nuclear waste disposal
Engineer blueprint acquired. So, do I come across nuclear waste or do I make it? something swimming beside me. Okay, we're gonna have to go. <coughs> Back to life pod four. Life pod four should be over here. stay at the surface so you have to bob up and down I think that's it there lights don't do much good Life Pod 4 anymore. Ah, darn it. You know what? Forget. We'll go to 13. <clears throat> we'll find Life Pod 4 later. Do I have my lights on? Yes. One point five kilometers away. Man. Can't see anything. Oh, except a giant wreck. Have I explored this wreck? First, we should drink something. And storage is on this side. Oops. I want to put all this stuff in here. Got a door. Uh, don't think we. No, we've definitely not been in here. What's this? Basic plant pot. Thought we had the basic one already. Oh, can we do the hanging pot too? poster. Natural selection. It's a, another game that was made by the same people. Okay, I'm 
gonna have to cut that door. Well, let's get some oxygen first. Is there anything in here? There's four things in here. Why can't I take one of them? Uh oh. <coughs> My flashlight died of battery. I got two batteries. Left. Go away, you little thingy. <laughs> um, stop banging on my ship. I'm trying to remember what I was gonna do, and I'm already doing it. Getting oxygen. Away. Gotta replace the battery. Gonna need lots of titanium. Oh, I don't go that way yet. Oh, look what I found. Picture frame. Blueprint acquired. And we got a cheek plant. Cheek or chick? Oh. Blueprint acquired. What were you? You want me to scan that guy? I think I already scanned him. Why are you tell me to scan over here? Everything. Uh, okay, go in there. Yeah. Oh, did I even bring my laser cutter with me? No, I did not. So, what we're gonna do is leave a beacon. Pick it up. Yeah. You had it there for a second. And then use a capital like a normal person. No. Got the key. Okay. Now that we have a beacon, we can come back and get lost a little. We can come back and uh, cut that thing open later. Some things here to scan. For the resources. Always for the resources. We need so many resources. Oh, oh it's one of those um, <laughs> tiger plants shoot their thorns at you. Rude little things. Well, 
we're finding some oh, inventory is full. Lots of nice resources so we can get that later on too. Six one meters away. So we'll stop off at base, empty our inventory, and then go there. Maybe we'll fill up on uh, food and water as well. Always got to fill up on food and water. <clears throat> I wonder if we can make, what do we need to make a power cell? Two batteries and a silicone rubber. We can do that. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, Tara. Um, what did I do with this silicone rubber though? I'm gonna use two empty batteries. Let's put all this stuff in here. Click, 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 click. Oh yeah, that, we almost filled it up. Excellent. Put our poster in the decoration box. And we need to bring our laser cutter with us in case we run into anything else we need to cut open. Uh, let's fill up with food and water. Try your bubble tree. Eight food, ten water. Okay, that's pretty good. Yeah, eat a few Chinese potatoes, and we're all full. Did I put this silicone? There wasn't any in here. That's organic. I guess we'll have to make some. Must have used it all. Uh, what do we need to make silicone? We need creep seed cluster. We just happen to have one growing. We don't have to go all the way over there anymore. We are growing our own. Another radio message. Yes, power cell. Okay. You have to have an extra power cell. This is life pod seven. Coordinates attached. Pod is structurally sound, but the fabricators bust. Requesting assistance. Seven out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to data bank. Another one. 
Distress signal have been received from LifePod 7, but the attached coordinates were corrupted. Last available photographic data has been downloaded and analyzed. Crew reported problems with their onboard fabricator sunk to 200 meters in area of low ecological activity. Transmission origin approximately one kilometer southwest of Aurora stern section. King. One kilometer southwest. Over there somewhere. And see now we have a beacon for the wreckage. Life pod, that's one point one kilometer. Hmm, which one should we go to? Well, this one actually has a signal, so let's go to this one, because the other one we have to search for. I As you've seen from my search for life pod six, it's gonna take a while. It's good we can chow around easier. Sea moth creates oxygen for us, so that's fantastic. Oh, another, uh, is this the same mushroom forest? Hard to tell. Oh, we're going into deep. Well, not that deep. We can go 300 meters down. Don't hit the eel. You never know what their oh, what their electricity will do to us. Another volcano. Volcano event. Something just hit us. Didn't like us, whatever it was. Moth. Closer. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. That's uh detecting volcanic activity and several unusual electromagnetic signatures in the region. Exercise caution when diving deeper. Okay. Obviously, that's volcano activity, and you can tell that guy's electric. Thirty-four degrees outside. We're at Thirty-six now. Okay, you gonna go away? Or you gonna hang around here? I don't want you to shock me. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. PDA. Integrating new PDA data. I'm uh, not really a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? 
I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. I run a self-scan and it tells me I've got skin irritation. The only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm actually going to die down here. I found a ruby. Okay, we'll read about the ruby some other time. Some useful outcroppings here. And these common bulb bush. Oh, look at that. Seconds. Giant thing of lithium. Sorry, fish. No, it's just an arch. Can we scan this guy without it killing us? Ow! Whoa, whoa, what happened to me? Oh, it almost killed me, that's what happened to me. Almost finished scanning you, okay? Do you like the heat? Get so close to you, it's can you? I can't get close to the heat there, buddy. What are you doing? Almost running out of oxygen. Yeah, I get some oxygen. Oh, go away, go away. Big meanie. in my ship. Where'd you go? They all disappeared. Huh? Oh, there you are. Stay away. <laughs> I just want to scan you. Damn it. Just let me scan you. 
You shouldn't have much left this can you anyways. Not his head. Too close. Finally, holy. That took forever. It seemed to be swimming slow. Maybe it's from the shock. Okay, do you need to be repaired? No. Nope. Let's get out of here. So we found um, life pod 12. I can turn that one off now. Get near the eels. Damage is holy. Sorry, fish. Another alien vent. See if there's anything in this mushroom forest to see. Other than mushroom trees. I don't see anything interesting. So, we're gonna head back home. Do you have any inventory space? I do. I can pick up some salvage on the way. I'm gonna pick up some metal salvage to make some more titanium. And we're gonna head back to uh, her base. episode here you don't really need to see me oh a light stick a light stick I need one more scan for that let's take this piece of salt So I hope you'll come back and join me next time. We will continue uh, going after. Um, God, I can't think now. We'll continue going after the different life pods that we got messages for. continue making our way to the laboratory which is 800 meters we can only go 300 so far with this sea moth 
I think we're gonna need um, the Cyclops to go that far deep. Which is cool. Cyclops is awesome, so I look forward to making that. And I look forward to seeing you next time here in Subnautica. So, I hope you come join us. And I'll see you then. Bye.